Celebrity barman Pascal Okechuku, popularly known as Kubana Chief Priest, has always been an ambassador for Cheat on Your Woman with Respect. But at the same time, he doesn't joke with his wife of seven years, Angel Gold Okechuku. Every market day on social media, fans often watch as the nightlife entrepreneur celebrates the mother of his two handsome boys. If the married lovebirds are not traveling together in a private jet or enjoying a luxury vacation, you can be sure that the popular brand influencer is promoting his wife's business on Instagram. Chief Priest doesn't fail to celebrate his marriage anniversary yearly and spoil his beautiful wife with expensive gifts on her birthday. On January 22, 2022, the celebrity barman broke the internet after splurging millions of naira on her birthday on a brand new Mercedes-Benz. He wrote, Asked my woman at the Angels what she wants for her birthday. She said get me a Benz. It's few days to her birthday. Congrats baby, it's a effing G class of the 63s. Above all, it's a freaky AMG. Now you can roar like a lioness that you are. Again, on their wedding anniversary on December 2nd of the same year, Chief Priest professed love to his wife for being patient with him for 7 years and then promised to throw a lavish white wedding for her in 2023. He wrote on his Instagram page, My white wedding na next year at the Angels. Next year, I will give you a wedding for the books. I think I have spent enough to be able to lavish 2023. Now my love, yeah, I'm so excited. 2023 now my love year at the Angels. Anyhow you want it, let's know, I'm ready. You were so patient for 7 years. Now I want to know how you want the wedding. Roasted, cooked or fried. Interestingly, not many have been moved by the nightlife entrepreneur's grand gestures to his wife. Kubana chief priest on the occasion of his wife's birthday got her an expensive Hermes Birkin bag. In the birthday message, he begged his wife to forgive all his shortcomings which many suspected was chronic cheating. He wrote, Beautiful things in the store at the Polo Avenue. It's my baby the angel's birthday in a bit. She's getting a real Hermes Birkin investment. Indeed how much are dollars. Happy birthday my wifey at the angel's. I wonder what life would have been without you. My angel, I'm forever loyal to you, baby. For all my shortcomings, Biko, I am so sorry. Just they manage, they go. The mother of two who runs a thriving bar and restaurant in Oweri was on vacation in Texas, US with her children while all this drama was happening. However, she told Nigerians that a Kenyan lady is not enough to break her home. She has been sharing many good wishes from family and friends, praying for a home amidst this scandal. One of them is a well wish, saying, no leave, no transfer. Also on her page, the mother of two shared an old video with Kubana chief priest, which she captioned, love forever. But this has not stopped other celebrities and Nigerians from dropping their two cents on the scandal and the reactions are mixed. One of the first people to react is a politician and popular Nollywood actress, Tonto Dike, the self-proclaimed Mama Di Papa who dislikes deadbeat men, chided women who didn't sympathize with the Kenyan lady. Tontolet then promised to take care of the mother and child. Some of her posts read, The comments here from fellow women are just despicable. It's hard knowing that the world lacks empathy and humanity. Half of you have made the same mistakes. Half were born from the same mistakes. But you choose to throw stones at a woman who is already bleeding. She added, to the mother and baby, I wish you both the very best. May you find the strength and love to take care of yourself and the baby. I'll communicate with GLB to see how I can help. Also reacting, Charles Awuzie, a Nigerian business mogul based in South Africa, 
has offered to take care of the welfare of the Kubana chief priest's alleged baby mama and child. Since Kubana chief priest has denied that the child with the Kenyan lady is his, I am offering to help with the child's upkeep. Kenyans are the brightest minds on the continent. A Kenyan sister can't be stranded with a newborn in Nigeria just because the man she believes to be the father denies responsibility. If she is still stranded in Lagos, I will help to get the Kenyan government to fly her back home," he wrote. He added that if she did not accept his offer, it would be just another plot to pull Kubana chief priest down, which would be unfair. Twitter music journalist Joe Akan wrote, Kubana chief priest, let the baby come home to his father. One user also tweeted, Kubana chief priest should go and take care of his son. The Kenya girlfriend deserves to be treated nicely. Another user also commented, Chief priest don't knock resemblance enter this girl body. Sea leaves are big. Amidst the scandal, chief priest took to his Instagram page to show off his expensive cars, white house and black cars only. Happy new week. Go out and prosper. He captioned, This immediately sparked mixed reactions online as some netizens noted that the Kenyan woman targeted him because of his wealth. One fan wrote, Now waiting this Kenyan girl CBDs. Another wrote, Now all these things the desperado see and start getting herself ready to reap where she did not sow. He no go work for her. In do you <laughs> Did I hear you say wahala? Let's know in the comment section what you think about Kubana chief priest and the Kenyan lady scandal. Who do you believe after all these breakdowns? Kubana chief priest or the Kenyan lady? He said too much things to me. But I told him, Pascal, I forgive you for everything that you did to me and your child. Mom, I know I'm not perfect. <laughs> the only thing that I wanted you just to come and take care of your child, no matter what. Because the baby will grow and they will ask me where is their father. Would you say the child resembles his alleged father or just his mother? Finally, what do you think about the reactions of the celebrity barman's wife? Would you say his marriage is still intact or threatened by the scandal? Share your opinion in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative, please comment, like and share. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to be notified every time I upload a new video so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.